Hello fam, happy Monday, how are we all? I hope you've been having a fantastic day and all my mamas out there, I hope you had a fantastic Mother's Day yesterday and either showered your mum with love or got showered with love yourself or both of course. Just inviting some people to join the party. Hello, hello. Give me a wave as you tune in, fam. Let me know that you can hear me. If you can't, please tell me. And we will get this party started in just a moment. If you've seen the caption, you... Oh, gosh, there's so many people online. Hello. We could be here all day. Um, yes, if you've seen the caption, you will know that we are going to be talking about what is wrong with most fitness programs that you've probably tried and failed on before. So we're actually going to dive into why you actually fell off the wagon. Um, this is going to set you up with the tools to stay on track next time and actually um, get a system in place that works for you. The reason that we're covering this topic today is, um, hey Jess, how you doing gorgeous? Um, I see it happen all too often. These these programs that, um, and I, you know, obviously I talk to a lot of girls who tell me that they've tried various programs before that just haven't worked. Hey, Ashley, hey, Dawn Lovely. Um, and I'm seeing a common theme through all of these things that people have told me that they've tried before. Um, I'm seeing a common theme. Hey, Meg, hey, Dawn Beautiful. Hey, Mini Mix. Hey, Tamika, hey, Dawn Gorgeous. Carly, hello, beautiful. Um, so I wanted to highlight this. I want to talk about what is wrong with most fitness programs, why they are actually, why you're falling off the wagon, what's going wrong there. Um, <clears throat> because you've, I'm assuming um, a lot of you have probably tried some sort of fitness program in the past, whether, you know, regardless of what it is, you've probably tried some sort of program that had an aim to either help you lose weight or get fitter, get healthier in some way. I am well, thank you, Meg. I hope you're well too, beautiful. Um, so while I'm talking, guys, I would love you to also chime in. You know, tell me what your thoughts are. Tell me if you have been through what I'm talking about. Tell me if there's something that you have been through that I haven't discussed. Let's chat, interact. Um, tell me if I'm not explaining something properly, of course, because you know I'm here to help you guys. So if there's something I can do to help you, then... Um, Yes, please tell me if I'm not explaining something properly, of course. But basically, um, I know how frustrating it can be to do a program of any sort and to fall off the wagon and feel like the failure that you feel like when um, you see other people adhering to it. But why can't you stay on track? Why do you fall off the wagon? Why you feel like a failure? You waste your money. You waste your time. You lose faith in yourself, which causes you to feel like you're never going to be able to achieve your goals. Hey, Katie, how you doing? Lovely. Um, and basically, the more times you try something and fall off the wagon, the less faith you have in yourself that you're ever actually going to get to where you want to be. And that's just damaging. And it's not fair. So, hey, Mac, how you doing? Lovely. Um, I wanted to talk about this and basically let's dive into what's wrong. Because the big, you know, the big thing here is, guys, that it's not your fault. You are not the failure. These programs are actually not set up for you to succeed. That's what's wrong. So what I want us to do is dive in and talk about that. We're going to talk about what is wrong with these other programs, why they are unattainable. And then what that's going to help you do is to understand why you have been falling off the wagon to give yourself a bit of faith back in yourself because it's not your fault. The system is failing you. You're not failing the system. The system is set up to fail you. So we're going to talk about that, which is going to help you believe in yourself again because once you know that it's not your fault that you failed, then you'll be able to understand that you do have it in you to actually succeed. Then I'm going to show you the things that you need to look for in a program and routine that is going to work for you so that you know what to look for so you know that you're going to find a program that will work hey megan how you doing lovely lady makes i think it does also come down to motivation your program speaks the volumes and helps assist women to get where they want ah thank you beautiful it absolutely does and we'll we'll look at that a bit as well like sort of coming into why i created forever fit the way i did based off a lot of shortcomings in the health industry um, because you, you guys know me, I'm a realist, you know, I'm not here to give you flashy shit that you don't need. I'm here to just be real and teach you how to live a healthy life in the way that is easy and sustainable. 
Um, Because we're not here to bend over backwards. We're here to have fun and enjoy life. And health should be a part of that. It shouldn't be something we have to go out of our way to achieve. Hey, Nikki, how you doing? Gorgeous. Good to have you here. Um, So I want to help you guys identify why these programs are set up to fail, why the system has been failing you. Um, So... Basically, I've just got some points here that I want to cover off and we'll talk about them in a bit more detail as to why they actually are um, a problem. And then um, from there, we'll have a look at the other side of that and what it is that you actually need to have in place so that when you are trying to actually successfully achieve a fitness goal, you know what you need to have in place to make it happen. No more wasting your time, no more falling off the wagon, and more importantly, no more feeling like a failure. And thinking that you just don't have it in you to get there so one of the first things that is wrong with a lot of these fitness programs is that they actually make you buy supplements of some sort as part of the program or they've you've got to adhere to purchasing something to continue getting the results so things like jenny craig um, hello fresh even though that's not necessarily a weight loss thing but they do now have a thing where they try to help you lose weight as well which You've always got to keep buying the meals. They don't actually teach you how to cook the meals. They just give you the food. And you've always got to keep buying it because they're not teaching you to effectively meal prep yourself. Um, They try to make you buy supplements. Like I know there's a lot of girls on my Facebook here who do things like Juice Plus and I don't even remember all of the names of the other ones that sell supplements to give you more energy, help you lose weight faster, all of these things that come in a pill or a juice or a, a liquid of some sort that you take. Essentially, they're giving you in a, a liquid and pill capsule form, the same things that you can already get from food, but they're just not teaching you how to use the food in the way to get it. So a lot of the, the shortcomings of a lot of these programs is that they'll make you purchase a supplement that you then have to keep purchasing in order to get the result that they're giving you. Hey, Carly, how you doing, lovely? Um, so that gets you stuck because if you get the results by doing something you don't intend to do for the rest of your life, once you stop doing that thing, you revert back, your body will revert back to where it was when you first started. So you end up going backwards once you stop taking whatever supplement it was that got you to lose the weight. So these supplement products, they want you to keep purchasing their product. That's why they give it to you. All they want you to do is be stuck using their product to keep your result. And they will tell you that it is the best thing in the world. But realistically, what they're hiding from you is the fact that you can get the same result from eating the right foods and doing the right exercises and drinking the right liquids. You don't need a special capsule to do any of it or a special drop of anything to do any to do any of it. And more importantly, you're already eating, so you might as well eat the right foods and then you're getting the result just by doing what you do every day instead of having to purchase a supplement on top of that. So that's one reason, because not all of us can afford to keep buying a supplement over and over again. So you're not going to adhere to that program forever. That is why you would fall off the wagon there and fail. Or if you miss an order and it doesn't come in or something happens in the postage and you can't get your supplies, you're going to fall off that wagon. You can't adhere to it because it is not in your control. The second reason that a lot of these programs are too unattainable is they're simply too strict and too complicated. So a lot of these programs will cause you to have to go out and purchase foods that you've never heard of before. You've got to cook a different meal for every, every meal of the day is different and you've got to cook new things every single day and it's way too time consuming. The exercises take too long and quite often you need a lot of equipment that you just don't have. So there's a lot of barriers there because you don't have the time to spend hours in the kitchen every day cooking random ass meals that you can't even be bothered doing. You don't have time to get to the gym for two hours at a time every single day. And if you can't get to the gym, a lot of the time you can't do the workout at home because you don't have the equipment. So a lot of these programs are unattainable in that way because you won't be, you you can't stick to the meal plans and you can't stick to the workouts properly. You're going to start dropping off here and there. You might go good for a week when your motivation is super high, but in those times where it gets tough and it's already tough to follow, it's going to be even harder to follow when you can't be bothered because it's too much of a bending over backwards going out of your way to stick to it. So you're going to fall off the wagon, but you're going to feel like the failure because the program has been sold to you as this amazing thing that works every time. You see other people adhering to it, but you only see them doing well. You don't see them struggling as well. When they are struggling, they don't show it. So you think that you're failing. So you give up on yourself thinking that you just can't do it. 
but it's not you, it was the program that failed you in that case as well. The other reason that you will find that a lot of these programs just aren't attainable is because there is no support. There is no one there to help you through. You might have a coach attached to the program, but can you message them 24 seven? Can you message that coach anytime, day or night and know that you're gonna get a response as soon as they see their phone? Because without that level of support, you have to answer whatever questions you have. If you have a question about a food swap, if you have a question about an exercise modification, if you're having a down day and you wanna know how to pick yourself back up and your coach isn't gonna get back to you except for an email every once a week, you are gonna to have to answer those questions yourself. And when you are new to this, that is almost impossible to do without self-doubt and thinking that you're doing it wrong. And when you think you're doing it wrong, you're gonna to wanna to give up. So without, hey Sal, hey you doing gorgeous? Without that level of support and someone there to actually answer your questions as you go and help you overcome any issues that you arise as you go, you, you have no choice but to fall off the wagon a lot of the time because you can't adhere to it if you don't know what you're supposed to do. Questions always arise and there is no way that one person could sit down in five minutes and tell you every scenario that you're going to come up against, every battle that you're going to face and how to overcome it in one conversation. It has to be dealt with on a case by case basis. When you come up against the obstacle, you ask your coach, you get the response, you move forward. And that is how you learn to make adaptations to every situation in your life so that you get to a point that no matter what happens, you can always stay on the wagon and you will learn how to adapt to any situation that happens. And that's how you get lifelong results. Without that support and ongoing education, you can't get that. You just can't reach that level. Hey, Cindy, how you doing? So of course you're gonna fall off because you're gonna doubt yourself if your coach isn't there to help you. The other thing that's wrong with a lot of these programs is that they simply aren't long enough. They're just not long enough. Four week shreds, six week shreds, eight week shreds. Heck, this is why 12 weeks Forever Fit wasn't even long enough. I decided to make it so that it's not just restricted to 12 weeks because if you, whatever you do for four weeks to achieve a certain result, isn't long enough, four, six, eight weeks, even 12 weeks is not realistically long enough to properly learn all of the lifestyle habits you need to know and actually have them as a habit to the point where you no longer need the structure of that program to keep you going anymore. So you do a six, a four, six, eight week program, you haven't had time to fully learn everything you need to know and all of the habits, you haven't had time to make them actual habits. So by the time the program ends and you lose that structure and support and routine, you end up reverting back to old habits again. It happens 100% of the time. So, okay, 99.9, .9, I can't be absolute about it, but very, very much a lot of the time you will revert back. So you need, you need to have it presented to you in a way where it's not time sensitive. You're not capped at four, six or eight weeks and that, you know, if you don't achieve your goal in that time, then you're screwed and you've got no support after that. And you just basically, that was just a waste of time. Hey, Crystal, how you doing? Lovely. So essentially, you, yeah, you need to have it presented to you in a way where you've got your own time to learn. You've got the, all the time you need to reach your goal and learn the necessary habits in the process so that once you reach your goal, you're actually in a position to maintain for the rest of your life because you've had that time to develop the habits and actually turn it into your lifestyle. So that's why these four, six and eight week shreds, they look all pretty and shiny. And yeah, they do get a few results in that short amount of time, but do you actually learn how to keep them in that time? No, not really. So they're selling you short. They're not long enough for you. And that's why a lot of those ones don't work long-term as well. You always got to keep doing them. You got to keep going back another eight-week challenge, another eight-week challenge. But you're always jumping from challenge to challenge, waiting for the perfect time to start said challenge. So they're not always back-to-back. -back. They're with, you know, quite spaced out. So by the time you start the next one, you forgot how the first one went and you're just going up, down, up, down, up, down. And that's not healthy for your body either. So that's why a lot of those ones fail for you. And the last reason that a lot of these programs fail, which really, really pisses me off, is the coaches don't really, really deeply care. And when I say that, I mean they might seem like they really do, 
and that they really want what's best for you. But if they really did want what was best for you, they would be there for you 24 seven for support. They would wanna help you round the clock as much as they possibly could. Not just once every blue moon, you know, one email a week kind of support. They know that these questions pop up more regularly than just once a week and they wanna help you actually through this, through each thing. So they, uh, there are just too many coaches out there that see fitness coaching as a lucrative industry and they just want your money. And I know I have spoken to a lot of girls who have come to me wanting help that have dealt with um, a lot of ML, MLM companies, multi-level marketing companies who sell products and things like that in the wellness space. And they feel like they get all this attention and love and support right up until the moment that they sign up and then they struggle to get any support from there on in. I'm not pointing any fingers at anyone who might do that, but I just from personal experience have had girls come to me and say that they've had that experience. And that, that saddens me because you know, once you take the leap to actually decide that you are going to go fully 100%, dive in and actually better yourself, I'm there for you to make that happen 100% of the way. If you need that support, you need the help to transition, to make the changes, to adapt your, your time schedule, your time management, all of those things, you need support from someone who's been there. And it's not fair for if you know if i was to then say okay yeah i'm going to give you all this support and then just not be contactable then what good is any of it for you if you can't learn how to implement the tools what good is it if i'm not there to yeah if you're not if i'm i can give you all the tools you you need but if i'm not there to teach you how to use them what purpose do they have what good are they so it'd be like you know giving a dog a book and expecting it to learn to read like what is a dog going to do with a book you know, like I, you need to teach. That was a pretty bad analogy because dogs are never going to learn to read a book. But like, <laughs> I'm usually pretty good with analogies too. I think I'm just getting so passionate about this. My brain's getting all fogged up. Angie, you are such a good coach. Makes you truly do change lives. Oh, babe. Yes. It, I love being a part of your journey, babe. It's so special just watching you absolutely thrive. Honestly, that's what I'm here for. Seeing you people make your transitions and seeing you absolutely thrive in your everyday life. Like every, every one of us deserves to be the happiest, healthiest, most confident versions of ourselves that we can be. And I want to help you do that. Um, and that's why I'm doing this video because I'm talking about why these things are, are failing you up until now. Um, but yeah, basically like, you know, what I was saying before, I could give you all the tools in the world, but if I don't teach you how to use them, what good are they? if you can't implement them. So that's why I've got to stick with you throughout the whole journey to help you implement it, which is why it annoys me when I see a lot of coaches leaving you high and dry and just not helping you implement the tools they give you. Um, and that's basically it. So those are the, uh, uh, the big reasons why a lot of these programs fail. So it's not you that is the failure. The system has been set up to fail you. And it's more often than not, if you strip it right back, it all comes down to money that whoever sold you, whatever program failed you, did it because it was an effective way to get money. That's basically it. Um, there's really only a few things that you need to look for in a program that that is guaranteed to get you the lifelong results. So essentially, the first thing that you need to look for is, is the program flexible? Can you adapt the eating plans to suit your needs can you adapt the workouts to suit your body? If you've got injuries, allergies, you work crazy shifts, you work funny hours, you're a busy mum that works as well, whatever your lifestyle is, can you adapt the eating plan and the exercise, the workout programs to suit your lifestyle and needs? Do you have injuries you need to modify the workouts for? Can you only train at the gym? Sometimes the rest of it has to be at home. Is it flexible to fit around your schedule? Because what you need to do is take the tools, which is how to eat, how to exercise, and learn how to implement them into your specific lifestyle. So realistically, that's all it takes, but it's it can be a process. So you need a system that is flexible enough to fit into your lifestyle so that you can do the things, do the, you know, the proper eating and do the workouts but in your time schedule, because everyone's time schedule is different. So if you're sticking to a program that requires certain things that you have to bend over backwards for, as soon as you finish it, 
you're not going to stick to that anymore it's too hard it needs to fit easily into your lifestyle that's why it needs to be flexible then it needs to um it needs to be time effective so it needs to be made up of things you know you need to be able to batch prepare your foods you need to be able to do the workouts in under an hour all of these things that so that it's it fits much easier into your day you know you're spending a little bit of time for a lot of gain essentially that's what you need from the meal plans and the workouts they need to be flexible and time effective then you need support make sure that the coach you're talking to is actually going to be there 24 7 around the clock for you to call on them or at least every day at least once a day because other than that you the questions go too long unanswered you doubt yourself you have to make the choice yourself you start to think you're doing it wrong and you start doubting yourself more and more so make sure that you at least have access to your coach every day now i i am available to the forever fit fam 24 7 they've got direct access to me through the fit life app so they actually send me a message i see the icon come up i know i've got a message from a fit fam member i go in i respond straight away and that that way i know that any any messages that come through on the app are immediate attention for me so they always get access to me as soon as they need me um and then basically yeah that with that support also brings the ability to learn how to fit it in to hey jesse how you doing mate brings the ability for you to learn how to fit things into your days because no your days aren't always going to be the same life is going to throw lemons at you you're going to have hard times mentally you're going to have ups and downs having constant access to a coach who can support you to stay on track is how you learn to cope with all of the different scenarios that life can throw at you so basically the idea is with forever fit the idea is that i teach you how to eat in a balanced and flexible way for your body and your lifestyle how to fit the workouts in around your um, lifestyle as well and also how to overcome mental blocks how to overcome you know down days low motivation how to overcome stressful situations like maybe you've got stuff going on with your family you're going on holidays all these sorts of things i teach you as we go how to stay on track while all of this crazy stuff is going on and what that does is it actually sets you up to be able to stay on track no matter what life throws at you and that means no matter how crazy life gets you will be able to maintain healthy habits and that is how you maintain for life but if i'm not there for you 24 7 then i can't teach you those things day in day out that's why i am there for you 24 7 because that's one of the most crucial parts it's all well and good for me to give you the tools but i have to teach you how to implement them hey candace how you doing lovely so that is that's why forever fit is created the way that it is because i see these downfalls in these other programs these short shred programs that don't set you up for life the lack of support from a lot of coaches no matter what they tell you they're going to do for you the fact that you know i i didn't want to make a program where you had to use supplements to get the result obviously because i'm not a supplement company so it's just regular everyday normal healthy food that you use that gets you into the shape that you want to be in so that it's just easy you're not bending over backwards everything is just you know simplicity is the mantra and where there's a will there's a way so it's all about finding the right way that works in for your lifestyle that's what it's all about that is why these other programs have failed before and yeah i, I just really wanted to highlight that it's not you that is the failure it's the system and the programs that you've been trying to use so yeah, I, I just don't want you to feel as though you are the failure and feel as though you're you're a lost cause basically and that you're never going to get your results because, you know, these companies and these other people selling these programs, they don't want to tell you about these things, about why they don't work because they just want you to keep buying their stuff. So I wanted to bring that to light because there's been few, far too many conversations I've had where I've had girls tell me that they've tried so many things before and that they haven't stuck to them and I've said why. Haven't you stuck to it? And these are the reasons that keep coming up. And these are the reasons that I had already identified that were downfalls of so many programs before. So, um, yeah, basically, I hope that's been insightful for you guys. Um, if you've got any questions about anything, um, maybe you are trying a program at the moment and you want to see if there's any holes in it that um, maybe it's not going to be as effective as you thought it was going to be. Um, or you'd like me to check it for you. If you've got any questions about 
diet or exercise in an easy, flexible way that suits your lifestyle and your goals. If you're not sure where to start, send me a message, send me a DM saying fit, and we'll have a chat a bit more about what your needs are and what an easy, flexible routine could look like for you that's actually going to fit into your lifestyle and get your results and enable you to keep them for life. So send me a DM saying fit if you would like to talk more about how I might be able to help you finally achieve your goals. Um, if you've got any questions about today's video, drop a comment here and tag me so that I see it. And of course, um, send me a DM if you've got any questions whatsoever. And yeah, we'll chat. Thank you so much for tuning in, guys. I really hope you did find this helpful. Um, it is a really, really important topic I needed to cover. Um, so yeah, I'll leave you with that and I will talk to you all very soon. I am off to go on train legs. So exciting times. Yay.